I would like to say something that this is probably why I couldn't get the help because they were probably told not to help me and then um that would explain why others are getting away with keep doing what they're doing so you know this is like really bad corruption and it just shows that they are helping the wrongdoing they are helping of breaking your amendment they're helping to break your rights as a human being not understanding that people who keeps going they do deserve to have prison they do deserve to get locked up because that's the torture that somebody thinks that they're going to teach you a lesson that's the thing no that's not the proper way to do it but I would love to understand something why why can the police do everything and then they don't get in trouble but when we do it we get locked up or we get in trouble I would really would love to understand that to make it make sense because there are people out here who have been trying to get the help and then I've kind of noticed it because I've been going through it I've literally tried to get the help that I need and then that's the perfect timing for others to want to sit there and say well you need to get help you need this or you're delusional but the problem is is that this is pretty much why the people that are being gang stalked RICO crime, this is actually organization. This is why they are denying of helping you knowing they're supposed to protect the rate. And it's pretty awful that um, passed away officers have came to me about this type of injustice. They're not too happy how things are going in the world but you know what eventually there's gonna be an investigation eventually in time they cannot destroy evidence because I've even looked it up and even prosecutors also have something to do with this like they're very corrupted they are literally helping someone to attack you to drive you nuts just to torture you to see if you're strong enough to handle it but um when you finally understand what they're doing why they're not helping you and then guess what when you know for a fact now i found this out that this is the reasons why people are retaliating this is why people are protecting themselves regardless because pretty much this is police showing people retaliation to that we do not deserve to live we deserve to die that's pretty much how i'm seeing it they target because they don't like you Pretty much they work with a whole bunch of people and not understanding that people do need to take responsibility and accountability for their actions of not understanding that this is why some people end up in jail. This is why a lot of people end up in prison and then the cops know exactly what they did of not helping you so guess what when you get in trouble get arrested they act stupid and said well why didn't you call us well apparently this shows me right here that some people were not meant to help so that's like a really big red flag right here with the gang stock and the rico crime the organization that this is the whole point 
that they know exactly what they're doing to you. They just don't want you to pick up on it. And once you do pick up on it, once you understand a little bit by little bit, these people will start getting scared. They will freak out. And then there's really nothing they can do about it. Because if you get locked up, it's because they set that up to be that way. So pretty much if somebody is like trying to get aggressive with you or wanting to kill you, not helping you, but they want to help out the accomplices, they want to help out the murderers, the rapists, the RICO crime actions, they want to stick up for the criminal activities. That says a lot about the system that when people start catching on to what is cheerfully going on, that's why we the people are always standing our ground like we do not tolerate. And then when people want to call the police, they're okay to help them because like this person said, it's like a program that there is something going wrong here that others can call the police on you they'll help them out but they're told not to help you so that's like a big reverse psychology right there that's like a really bad illusion so guess what now people understand this and heard this that says a lot about the community and about the police and the feds. That says a lot about them. This is actually something that a lot of people think that they're cute. But not understanding. They can actually lose their jobs. They can lose their positions of trying to hide the evidence or destroy evidence. Knowing that everything is there. And they know it. There's no way of wiping it clean. So once you catch on to this. And I've kind of noticed. That when I try to call to get the help that I need. I was denied the help and the right justice. Always got treated unfairly. This is probably why. They let rapists, murderers, attempted, committed criminal activity on me they let these people get away with it thank you for helping me to understand have a good night